Hey guys, so review here for me. Sorry uh, again for very uh, low quality here, but I'm on vacation so I don't really have much of anything. Anyways, Supernatural episode 4 was again, this is exactly like it was with the last season. Episode 4 was one of my favorite episodes of season 11, the baby episode. Well, this one didn't have obviously a very intricate sort of... Uh, of a filming style. This one was a really good episode because it touched on something that hasn't been touched on since season six, which was Sam's powers. And this episode was good because not only while the story seemed a little bit simplistic, it was the overall kind of feel and this the undertone of the entire episode that as long as you were a fan of the show, you wouldn't understand every single aspect the show was talking about. This episode, sorry. What happens was they go and find this fan, this woman who's been killed very much in the way of how Christ was killed in this church, and it leads them to this family who's this God-fearing family. And what's very interesting is they talk about how you met God, like, do you understand God, like, we're doing God's will. And the thing is, the boys have met God. So Sam actually gives this mother a one-to about how it actually is and I actually liked that because it reminded me of when Sam met God and we knew from the early on in the show that Sam was a religious person he prayed and after this episode like when he found out about the angels his faith was decimated and then when he met God it was even more so so to see that anger from all those basically that 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 self-doubt that uh, that letdown that he's experienced throughout all these years, we saw that being focused on this woman, and that was cool. Dean also being kind of this 13-year-old girl, as he says, with his mother, and the fact that they have to understand about needing space, and he's basically trying to figure out whether his mother is afraid of him. He's basically having anxiety of what happened with his father, basically, is that he finally has a, a parenting figure again, his father wasn't the best, but it was a parenting figure, and now he's afraid the same thing is going to happen with his mother. Overall, this episode as well, the whole dynamic of the family was also very cool. I like the fact that we had a psychic person back in the show. Did we explain how they were psychic? No. Did they kind of just write off how Sam totally lost his powers? Yes. But either way, just the connection that these two had was a very interesting sort of dialogue between the show. I enjoyed the fact that she was going through very much what he, that what Sam dealt with with Kevin. Was it? No, it wasn't Kevin. I'm trying to remember the boy's name from season two, the one who had the psychic powers and killed his stepfather and his and his uh, all these members of his family. I love that episode. That's one of my favorite episodes from season two. So when I saw, was it season two or was it season one? I'm trying to remember. Um, but either way, I still very much enjoyed this episode. I like the dynamic of the episode, how it touched on previous things, and I did enjoy how we got a little bit more of an in-depth vision into the boys. We saw more intricacy of the characters rather than of an episode itself. While there was a few things that were kind of just written off, like the sidekick abilities and then where Sam's went, I still thought this episode was very good. I enjoyed it all the way through. I'm going to give this episode a 7 out of 7. I thought it was good. Like, it's not as good as Baby. Baby was really good. But in terms of an episode that was actually full-on great, both in character, story, and dynamic, I liked that. I also liked how Dean kind of made the joke about how those two, Castiel and Crowley, are cops and they're teaming up. Which is exactly what I said the last time, so I'm interested in that. Anyway guys, sorry again for the quality of this review, but I will promise that the next ones will be up to date. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time.